Let's see children, one, one more interesting, quite interesting this particular sum is. Find the coordinates of circumcenter and the radius of the circumcircle of triangle ABC if A71, B35 and C2,0 are given to us. So what this concept is all about? This concept is all about drawing circumcircle. So let me refresh you a very simple figure. This is what I have drawn. But before that, construction of circumcircle. What is and how, how do we go for construction of circumcircle? Children, we always go for a triangle. We always go for a triangle. Let me draw a bigger one slightly. We always go for a triangle, perpendicular bisector of one side, second side. This is the circumcenter. With this as a center, either this distance or this distance or this distance as a radius, we go for a circle. Didn't we do all these things in our basic classes, lower classes? We did. We did. Or even in that year also. So that's what, you know, since from the point of circumcenter to the point of vertices of the triangle, that is termed as circumradius. That's what I have taken. So PA, PB and PC. I have not drawn any perpendiculars, but I have said that my point P is the circumcenter. Whose coordinates I am supposed to find out? Find the coordinates of circumcenter. So this is our circumcenter. It reflects as point P in our diagram. These are A, B and C of circumcircle of triangle A, B, C. Whose coordinates are given to you? So I intend to find out coordinate of point P. I hope you have understood the question. Children, we have done similar question earlier also. We have done similar question. Over there also we had taken P, A is equal to PB is equal to PC. You remember, out of the three, pick up any two, you will get a simultaneous linear equation. Solve it. That's what again the answer for this particular question is. So let's start. Let's start with your answer. What will I write down? I shall write down. Let A 7 1 X 1 Y 1 B 3 5 x2, y2, c, 2, 0, x3, y3, be the vertices of triangle ABC. Let P, h, k be the circumcenter of triangle a, B, C. Can I say P being a circumcenter? Therefore, therefore, P A is equals to P B is equals to P C. Radii of same circle or you can say circum radii of same circle. Radii of same circle. Right children? What next? On the same lines, now can I say since PA is equal to PB, which is equal to PC. So out of the first one, PA, PB. Second one, PB, PC. And the third one, PA, PC. Out of three, I'm supposed to pick up any one. Out of three, I'm supposed to pick up any one. Right? What I shall pick up is first PA, PC. What I shall pick up is PA, PC. So PA, PC is what I'm picking up. Since PA is equal to PC by distance formula by distance formula why did i pick up papc i'll tell you that by distance formula what will i uh, what will i get the answer as what answer will i get it if i go for distance pa apply distance formula we need not write down the formula we can directly work out the answer by substituting the coordinates mind you we will not write down the formula we directly work out the coordinates so h minus 7 the whole square in the figure is what you should be looking at h minus 7 the whole square plus k minus 1 the whole square for pc it will be under root of for pc it will be under root of h minus 2 the whole square plus k minus 0 the whole square i want to get rid of the square root sign how will i get rid of square root sign Taking squares on both the sides. Taking squares on both the sides. On taking squares on both the sides, my square root gets cancels off, nullify each other. What I'm left with? 
h minus 7 the whole square, k minus 1 the whole square, h minus 2 the whole square, plus k minus 0 the whole square is k square. Is this a minus b the whole square? Indeed. I'm writing direct answer. a square minus 2ab plus b square. Is this a minus b the whole square? Indeed. a square minus 2ab plus b square. Is z equals to a minus b the whole square? a square minus 2ab plus b square plus k square. Right? Children, h square, h square gets cancelled off. k square, k square gets cancelled off. h square, h square gets cancelled off. Either side of the equal to sign, we have same terms, we can cancel it. k square, k square gets cancelled off. So what I'm left with? I'm left with what? Bring all the h and k's on one side. Minus 14h. Minus 4h when it comes over here becomes plus 4h. Plus 49 plus 1 is plus 50. But before that, minus 2k. There is no k term here. So minus 14h plus 4h minus 2k. Here it is plus 50. When it goes over there, it becomes minus 50. So here it is plus 4 minus 50. Minus 14h plus 4h minus 10h. Minus 2k is minus 46. Divide by, divide by 2. Divide by 2. I'm left with what? Minus 5h. Minus k is minus 23. Let this be my equation number 1. Let this be my equation number 1. Any problem? Right? So, we have gone with PAPC. Now, it's your choice. PAPB, PBPC. I'll take PBPC. I'll take PBPC. What next? Since it's a very lengthy sum, children, so I'm forced to do this kind of I'm forced to do this kind of things. Let's start. PBPC also. PB is equals to PC. Again, by using distance formula. Let not write down once again. H minus 3 the whole square. Plus K minus 5 the whole square. K minus 5 the whole square. Is equals to PC. We have written down PC. So simply write down the same thing. Simply write down the same thing. What I'll write down? H minus 2 the whole square plus K minus 0 the whole square. Any problem children? Taking squares on both the sides. Taking squares. Taking squares on both the sides. What I'm left with? h minus 3 the whole square, k minus 5 the whole square, h minus 2 the whole square plus k square. Now, on the right hand side, don't you think so the term is going to be the same? Why? Because it is PC, the entire PC. So, on the right hand side, I'm going to have the same term. Left hand side, a minus b the whole square, a square minus 2ab plus b square, a square minus 2ab plus b square. On the right hand side, a square minus 2ab minus 2ab plus b square plus k square. h square minus 4h plus 4k square. The same. Cancel terms. h square, h square. k square, k square. What I'm left with? I'm left with minus 6h minus 10h minus 16h. Minus 16h. Uh, I'm so sorry. I'm really sorry, children. This is not uh, minus 10h. This is k square minus 10k. I'm really sorry for that. So, it is minus 6h. Minus 4h when it comes over here becomes plus 4h. There is no k term involved. Minus 10k. 
plus 9 plus 25 plus 34 goes on that side becomes minus 34. So it is plus 4 minus 34. Minus 2h minus 10k is minus 30. Can I divide? Divide by 2. What will I get it? What will I get it? Uh, here also I got it 5hk minus 23 over here if I divide it minus h minus 5k is equals to minus 15. Let this be my equation number 2. So I have 5h k 5h minus 5k. What according to you is visible? Should I multiply equation 2 by 5? If I multiply equation 2 by 5, will I get hh same? Right? So multiply. Multiply equation 2 by 5. Minus 5h minus 25k 75, 15 into 5 is minus 75. This is my equation number 3. Now check equation 3 and equation 1. Is the coefficient of the same? H is same. Signs are same. Same signs subtract. Subtracting. Subtracting. What children? Subtracting equation 2 from equation 3. So write down equation 3 first. Minus 5H minus 25K is minus 75. Minus uh, 5H minus K equals to minus 23. Change the sign. We are subtracting. So we change the sign. Plus. Plus. Then comes. Uh, yeah, here. It is not equation 2. It is equation 1. Subtracting equation 1 from 3. Mind you. Subtract equation 1. We are taking equation 1 from 3. So plus sign. Plus sign. Plus sign. I am left with what? This gets cancels off. Minus 25k. Plus k. It's minus 24k. Minus 75 plus 23, minus 52. Minus minus it cancels off. K equals to 52 by 24. 4, 13 times 4, 6 times. The value of K is 13 by 6. The value of K is 13 by 6. Right, children? Are you getting me? Next. We need to find out H also. So how we find out H? Substituting. Substituting. As I said, this sum is lengthy, children, so I have to write down in this way. Can't help it. Substituting k equals to 13 by 6. Which equation would you do so? In equation 1? In equation 1. So, minus 5h minus k is minus 23 minus 5h minus k is 13 by 6 so minus 13 by 6 is minus 23 bring this minus 5h here this one here 23 minus 13 by 6 is 5h lcm 23 6 -a. those who don't know multiple of 23 no issues 26 -a, 120 3 6 are 18. 120 plus 18, 138. 138 minus 13 by 6 is 5H. This is 125 by 6. This 5 comes down is equals to H. 5 1 times 5 25 times. H is nothing but 25 by 6. I got my coordinate. We have to stretch beyond children. We have to stretch beyond further also here. We have to stretch beyond here. Why? What we got at up till now, we got circumcenter. We got circumcenter. H comma K. Therefore, I can say, therefore, the coordinates of circumcenter is P with H comma K 25 by 6 comma 13 by 6. We are done with only the first part. Now they are asking us what is the radius? What is the radius? Answer is very simple. Either PA or PB or PC. 
इधर पी ए और पी बी और पी सी योर चॉइस वट अकॉर्डिंग टू यू यू शुड टेक शुडन टू टेक पी सी वाई पी सी वी हैव अ डायरेक्ट आंसर ह्योर ह्योर इट इज एच स्क्वायर माइनस फोर एच प्लस फोर प्लस के स्क्वायर राइट और इट्स योर चॉइस सो इफ आई से नाउ सरकम रेडियस और रेडियस आई शैल से पी सी यूजिंग डिस्टेंस फॉर्मूला यूजिंग डिस्टेंस फॉर्मूला एच नोन टू मी वॉट इज इट ट्वेंटी फाइव सिक्स सो आई राइट ऑन ओवर योर ट्वेंटी फाइव बाई सिक्स के नोन टू मी थर्टीन बाय सिक्स सो वॉट इज द आंसर बाई यूजिंग डिस्टेंस फॉर्मूला बाय डिस्टेंस फॉर्मूला अंडर रूट ऑफ ट्वेंटी फाइव बाई टू ट्वेंटी फाइव बाई सिक्स माइनस टू द होल स्क्वेयर प्लस थर्टीन बाई सिक्स माइनस जीरो द होल स्क्वेयर चिल्ड्रन आई एम गोइंग टू डू अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग कैलकुलेशन वेन यू टेक एल सी एम इंटू सिक्स इंटू सिक्स सो ट्वेंटी फाइव माइनस ट्वेल्व बाई सिक्स इज थर्टीन बाई सिक्स द होल स्क्वेयर प्लस थर्टीन बाय सिक्स माइनस जीरो इज थर्टीन बाय सिक्स द होल स्क्वेयर I want my children to help me out further. I'll I'll write down below. If somebody says a square plus a square, can't I write down two a square? So I'll consider thirteen by six square as a square. Under root of a square plus a square, two a square. So two times thirteen by six, the whole square. Now children. This square and square root get cancels off for thirteen by six, but not for two. So if I split, the answer is going to be root two into thirteen by six. So P A, which is nothing but radius, which is thirteen by six root two units. I hope you have understood this. Two a square plus a square two a square. We want to remove this root sign, so this square and this root gets nullified, but it's only for thirteen by six, not for two. So this root two remains for two. Dot thirteen by six, thirteen by six root two units. That is my circum radius. That is my circum radius. So circum center, I got it, and my circum radius. You could have gone for PB also. You could have gone for PC also. Choice is yours. I had taken PC because I have given you the reason. That was the reason why I did take PC. You have only one value of k. You don't have in terms of k n. Though we have a simultaneous linear equation in some other sum, the sum which we did, I give you the technique that we can avoid simultaneous linear equation depending upon the coordinates we take. Are you getting me, children? Oh, one of the best sum you can have it from coordinate geometry. One of them.